welcome back everybody. This is Didsbury Art Studio and I'm Sally and in today's video we're going to be doing a little bit more fabric slashing. This is something I'm really interested in and I want to explore it and develop it a little bit further as a textile technique. So let's get into it. So for this video I'm going to use a load of scraps that I know that I've had left over from projects. So yeah, those are, those are them. And this is a massive bag of scraps here. And yeah. And what I'm going to do is organise these into four different colours. Here is some old denim from a pair of jeans. Random shape. And what I want to do is, do you remember this sample that I did previously in another video? I really liked this effect here where you've got the pleating and you run the sewing machine the opposite way and you get that kind of bit like that one as well. So I want to kind of do that with this piece. So what I've done is I've drawn out some long lengths. There's about two and a half centimeters in between these lines here. And I've clipped the left hand side there so that I can slip in the fabrics. So what I'm gonna do next is I'm going to almost have this color here and then we're gonna go but I'm gonna go with these colours and then on to I wanted to have kind of like darker going to lighter sort of fabrics and I've been pressing down as I go along just to check how thick things are. All that's left to do is fold your fabric over. So I just gave my fabric an iron. So I just put the clips all the way around just to hold it together. Next up, I'm just going to do runner stitch on the lines. to cut through now. It's open all the way around the piece. I can just nudge my scissors into the fabric like so and just start quitting through. done now is four and a half centimeters each across and I've done a chalk line all the way to the top so now we're ready to sew is fold back these edges as I sew along so I'm doing runner stitch now it looks like this and what I'm going to do next on the next line here is I'm going to turn the fabric, the denim fabric, that way, the opposite way. And let's 
see what happens. So now it's looking like this. It's starting to get that kind of twisty denim fabric tuck going in there. But I love it. Okay, so there's the finished result. Delighted with it. You can see how it's gone from the kind of beigey brown into the dusty pinks and into the creams. Love that. And then this is just great. I love it. This was the effect I was looking for. Obviously, I've slashed it through. I've got all of those sort of textured fabrics, laces and satins, all sorts of different things coming through. And then you can see it's just kind of got this wave effect and the pleats have been able to be pushed down with the strength of the stitch on the sewing machine. So yeah, really pleased. With that. I just wanted to see what this would look like on the mannequin just because I love seeing what textiles looks like on the body form. So yes, doesn't it? As a little top thing of fabric looks good at the side. So I hope you enjoyed this video today. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you'd like to. And let me know in the comments if there's anything else that you'd like me to do. Take care of yourselves and I will see you soon. Bye bye.